Groove City Radio. The station that is with you everywhere. In your car. At your work. Or on your phone. Maybe even on your date. If you want us, we are anywhere you want us to be. GrooveCityRadio.com Hi everyone, I'm Gareth Whitehead. And I'll be hosting the Bullet Dodge Records show every Friday night on Groove City Radio. We've got a full packed show this evening. We've got tracks old and new from the label, just to give you a taste of what we're all about. We've got an interview from producer extraordinaire Lenny D. A mix from one of our very own, DJ Wardy. And a selection of newbies for you that's come out on the label. First up though in the track that's currently playing is a track called Exalted B by Brickman and Kirill Maviv. This is going to be relieved this is going to be released on Monday the 19th of August. So it's coming out on Monday guys. Check it out. Exalted B, and that's coming out in the label on Monday, folks. So, as I said, this first show, we're just going to kind of revisit uh, some of the label's back catalogue just to give you a taster of what we're all about. This next song is a song by producers Lovek, and the track's called Misdirection. Now, this was the first track ever released on the label way back in about April 2008.
track actually by myself um, was released uh, again late 2008 the track's called Count Me In and this is a Spectra remix Thank you. 
That last track was tracked by myself called Count Me In and that was the Spectre remix. This next track is a track called Jenga Lord by Jay Pace. This was released in 2009.
next we have an interview with the legendary New York producer, DJ and label boss, Mr. Lenny D. Lenny D uh, and Christian Scott collaborate, collaborated recently on a single called The Need, which was released on Bullet Dodge several weeks ago. So we caught up with uh, Lenny recently, and here's the interview. Hi, my name is Lenny D. I'm the owner of Industrial Strength. I'm a DJ, producer, mix engineer, and I own Industrial Strength Samples. So how did this collaboration come about? Well, Chris and I know each other a really long time. Um, actually, we used to live close by each other when we were kids. Um, so we met up uh, recently and um, decided it would be fun to uh, try to make something together. So we, we got together for a couple of weeks and uh, we didn't have any pressure on what to make, what we wanted to make. We just naturally, organically sort of put the whole project together. We designed all the sounds first and then from there we just started writing and all the tracks started evolving and changing and we kept writing new songs all the claps the snaps the claps the little beeps you hear we recorded uh, in this room actually uh with our our face our hands uh so we we kind of went a little over the top on it and, uh, yeah, it was it was a fun project what was the inspiration behind the need well, the inspiration for, for for the need and for some of the other tracks that are going to be coming out soon uh, on Bullet Dodge um, were just uh, really taking minimal and some house uh, and deep lyrics and trying to create um, something modern but something that had a bit of an older feeling to it you know chris and i basically didn't really think about it when we made the stuff we we just started doing it uh we kept ourselves quite uh restrained with the sounds we were using which kept forcing us to keep writing and becoming more creative with our ideas and evolving the drums and some of the sounds that we used uh, the Need is one of the first tracks uh, in, in, the, in the collection of, of songs that we did. Uh, the next one is called Jitterbug, and it'll be coming out on one of the Bull Dodge compilations coming up. So uh, it's a bit more instrumental, and we did everything live with, uh, with the Ultra Harmonizers, and uh, it's a really crazy track. Aside from this partnership, what other projects are you working well, on? Well, I'm actually doing a host of things. Uh, I'm really busy with my sample packs uh, at the moment. I'm working with a with a, a band out of the out of the UK, uh, Tombs, which is sort of a crossbreed of uh, like metal and electronic hardcore. Uh, I'm also, funny enough, writing some other types of songs with uh, a few sound design buddies of mine, uh, trying to create uh, a, a different kind of project a bit more with you. lyrics and you uh, electronic and techno kind of vibe um, there's a lot of things happening at the moment I just finished a lot of hardcore need. tracks the, <laughs> which is pretty need. funny and you the next few releases coming out on bullet dodge are from with Chris and I are pretty smoking and I'm quite you happy ab- about them so you'll be hearing all that stuff you quite soon um, so it's it's been uh, it's going to be a really crazy busy year actually. Well, that's great. Thanks very much, Lenny, for coming and chatting to us. And that was Lenny D chatting to us there. This next track is a track called "Troubling" by Mark and Stevens.
track was a track called Troubling by Mark and Stevens. Next we're jumping forward to 2010. We've got a track by a producer called Presuming Ed. The track's called Second Wind and this is a drum complex remix.
last track was called Second Wind. The original producer was Presuming Ed, and that was the Drum Complex remix. You'll probably hear quite a bit from Drum Complex at the moment. He's doing a lot of collaborations with fellow Dutch producer Ruel Salamink. Talking of Ruel Salamink, next we have a track um, by him called Oranical. Now, this is actually the Pascal Castell and Steve Ward remix. This was released in early 2011. The package also consisted of remixes from Robert Hood and Roger Martinez.
So that last track was called Rucano R- by Rose Salamink and that was the Pascal Castell and Steve Ward remix. Okay, next up we have the Silicon Soul remix of Soul Camp's Walk With Me. Walk with me.
Groove City Radio. Okay, that last track was uh, Silicon Souls remix of Soul Camp's Walk With Me. We talked earlier with the man himself, Mr. Lenny Dean, and he was discussing his track called The Need that he did with uh, Christian Scott. So, to give you a little taster of that track, here we have it here. So this is Lenny Dean, Christian Scott, The Need, and this is the house main mix. That last track was Lenny D and Christian Scott's The Need, and that was a house main mix. Okay, we're now going to give you a little sneak preview of what's coming out in Bullet Dodge very shortly. This next track is a track by producer G40. It's called Just a Feeling, and this will be released at the end of September 2013. Check this out, folks.
City Radio. So that last track was a sneak preview for you. The artist was G40, the track name Just a Feeling. That will be released in Bullet Dodge towards the end of September 2013. So stay tuned for more information on that over the next few weeks, folks. I'm going to leave you uh, tonight with a mix uh, from Bullet Dodge's very own DJ Wardy. DJ Wardy's from Paisley, Scotland, and this mix was taken from February of this year. Hope you enjoy, folks.
This is coming to the end of this week's show, folks. Hope you've enjoyed what you've heard. We'll be back next Friday with some more Bullet Dodge music and some other music from all over the world. For more information on the label and what we're up to, please go to www.bulletdodgerecords.com. Thanks for tuning in. Speak soon. Groove City Radio. Come join us at 